So by the title of this video, you want to level up in 2024. I'm going to be breaking down five steps, how you can improve yourself in 2024. And you're going to look unrecognizable by the end of the year. Let's get into it. So the first out of the five steps that I have for you is the most important one, because if you don't use this one, none of the other steps are going to be possible. And the first step is you have to discipline yourself. You can't just make a new year's resolution and then do it for two weeks and stop. Like you can't be a weak minded person. You have to just do stuff that you don't want to do. You have to learn from your mistakes and that's how we grow as humans. So every single day, try and challenge yourself by doing something that you don't want to do. Put yourself out of your comfort zone as much as you can meet new people. Just do stuff that you don't want to do. Always discipline yourself. That is your job. You can learn so much from it. And yeah, like I said, you can't do any of these other steps without discipline. That's also where hard work pays off. Disciplining yourself. That's the first step to success. Step number two for me, I'm trying to pursue this one as much as possible this year. And that's going to be making money. I feel like for me, I really haven't really made that a priority. So this year, that's what I'm going to be trying to do. If you guys want a video on how to make money, I can show you how I've made a little bit of money this year. Um, getting money is also going to supply a couple of these other things, especially if you're a younger person. Um, but I mean, getting money, you can invest it in yourself, which in my opinion is very important because I live really big on health. Um, and I mean, being a healthy human, um, you're going to have to invest money in yourself if you want to be a hundred percent healthy and just thriving, I guess you could say. Um, so try and make some money, try and pocket some, even if it's just a couple side hustles or you want to get a job, it's going to help you so much in the long run. And yeah, make some money this year. Just don't slack. Now, number three, I think this is one of the most important things. I like to be a well-rounded person. So I think learning a new hobby every single year is one of the best things that you can do. If you're good at say basketball, right? Go learn golf, like try a new sport, try a new hobby, go surfing. If you live by the ocean, go mountain biking get good at photography, try new hobbies. And that's see, that's where the money comes in. You can invest that money in a new hobby, which a new hobby. If you, the more you learn, the more, you know, it shapes you into a better person. So that's why I believe picking up a new hobby for me this year, I'm trying to get good at golf or I'm also trying to get good at football. So, yeah, that's just a couple examples. Um, I mean, even the smallest little things, you could get into journaling, you could go to the sauna, go into the gym. Um, yeah, just stuff like that is gonna help you succeed in life. And if you wanna be a better person in 2024, I recommend that you do that. Now, number four. Um, if you're talking about health, this is one of the most important things. Um, nutrition, I made a whole video, I'll pop that up right here. Um, yeah, go watch that video if you want a video on what I think a healthy diet looks like. Um, just as what my personal experience, like what I believe is healthy for a human. Um, for me, healthy diet, healthy eating, that's also just helped for me. Um, I've been hitting the gym and com a combination of that with my diet has helped me get a little bigger. I think eating a lot of meat is good. I believe clean plant sources like fruit are really good too. So that's just what I believe. And I mean, if you're eating healthy, you're gonna feel so much better and you're gonna be in way better mood. Um, when you eat junk, you really, really notice it. So just try to 
you know, make that a priority of yours, which another reason why the money is important. You gotta invest it in your diet. So yeah, that's reason number four. So the fifth one is actually, you know what? Scrap that. I think this one is the most important one because it's gonna be putting your words into action. For me, I mean, I've started YouTube channels in the past. This one, I wanna go strong with this one. I think that people can just say, oh, new year, new me. Are they really gonna be doing that though? Are you gonna be the same person or are you gonna be a completely different person? If you don't, if you don't keep moving forward, you're gonna get stuff like cement. You just have to put your words into action. Be a man of his word. Like, you can't just say something and not do it. If you say something, maybe it just goes over your head. Really think about that for a second. Can you do that? Because if you really believe you can, then you're already halfway there. You just got to put it into action. If you want to be a YouTuber, if you want to be a professional swimmer, like put it into action, train at that every single day. All these other things, put it into action. Get it, get healthier if you diet, start working out, make some money, do all those. Stop scrolling on your phone, do something about it. Don't be a little fat little fuck, do something about it. Like. I don't know how people can live their life and just make excuses for themselves. You have to do something about it. How you wake up and just scroll on your phone. People don't realize how unhealthy they are. You have to put your words into actions. And for me, I feel guilty if I don't know. Like, I think that's where I'm at right now. Just do something about it. Don't wish that you could be something else. Go out and do it. I'm not trying to be all motivational right now, but like, for real, it, you can do it. Trust me on that one. So those were my five ways that you can improve yourself in 2024. Be a completely different person this year. Um, number one was to discipline yourself. Number two was to make money. Number three was to pick up new hobbies, experiment with stuff. And number four was take care of yourself, whether it be your diet or just yourself in general. Um, and number five is putting words into action. You gotta do stuff, all right? So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and sub, um, it means a lot. So I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers really soon. I think I can do it. And yeah, I'm gonna put my words into action when I say that. All right, <laughs> peace out y'all.